Hello and welcome to Furry Ears World where we are back on the Sky Den and I have had an idea. It's probably not a great idea, it's probably a crap idea, but lasting principle. I have actually had an idea, so we're gonna we're gonna try and we're gonna try and embrace the idea. I suspect it's going to be uh, a, an episode-spanning idea. Um, it's all about gold and the acquisition of it. I was thinking about it all day today, thinking how could I get more gold without selling all my fruit and veg to, to stupid Philippe or whatever his name is. I can't remember his name now. But he's he's... He's just slowly fleecing us. He's getting a lot of stuff off us, and he's he's giving us very little in return. So we need a better way of getting gold, because we need Karus. I'm also also thinking that we might be able to use Ender Pearls for Karus, because they are currently a renewable resource. Any more cactus? One more cactus. Okay. So we need to go get buy some sand. Sand is ingredient du jour for us at the moment. I should have left some stuff in that chest. I'm, I've got my wand on me. I'm not happy about this. Shouldn't be going this way with my wand. It's a bad idea. And it'll be a bad idea made worse by my gross incompetence. Just you wait and see. So my plan. My plan is to get more gold. And gold comes from two sources. Fritz, the uh, robbing git. Or I'd like to trade. And I would like to buy some sand, please. Or... I can get it from um, pigmen. Harvesting the delights of the pigmen, um, which, 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 as we all know, isn't a treat. Uh, nobody, nobody likes to harvest the pigmen. They're an absolute pain to harvest, uh, and I've been trying to figure out the best way of harvesting pigmen without aggroing the nuts out of them and getting them all on my case. And I think my decision. My plan, my cunning plan. Look at my, my marvellous Thumecraft room over there. That's amazing. That's truly an awesome sight. Uh, it's going to look amazing with my chicken farms. I think they're going to go up that sort of way. Whoop, don't want to walk off. Above the Arboretum somewhere. Or maybe... I don't know, the mob trap's going to be out the back, isn't it? So the mob trap's going to be out beyond the, the cobblestone generator. Maybe, or maybe over over that platform, maybe, I don't know. I don't know, I haven't worked it out yet. Obviously, I'd like all stuff eventually to be brought back here. Uh, let's get some sand in there, and let's get some sand in there. So we're making glass. Glass is the, the item that is going to save our bacon. Quite literally, save our bacon. Uh, like grey wool. Hell, oh, I remember. We had a disaster, didn't we? There was, there was fire, there was misery... Uh, have we got any wheat on us? No, we've got some seeds though. We could breed one type of animal, but not the right type of animal. Let's go get some wheat. Let's breed these 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 sheep again, because uh don't wanna don't wanna lose my sheep. I know this game has a predisposition to uh screw me over vis-a-vis -vis animals, so I will I will just generally not go down that avenue. Alright guys, here's a bit of wheat for you all. There you go. Have some have some cow nookie. Let's try and put that as politely as possible. I want you all to have cow nookie. I'll even leave you alone while you're doing it. So right, so we're cooking off sand. And do we have any signs? We don't have any signs. Let's make a crap ton of signs. Because signs are the wave of the future, I feel. Uh, we'll just make that many sticks, and then we can just do this. In fact, if we do that, oops, the daisy. That's gone badly. That's The word we're looking for there is badly. And that will make us a lot of signs. Look at all those signs. The writing is on the wall with the signs. We'll pop them all back in there. We'll take a load of cobblestone with us, and we'll head to the nether. Because pigmen are us. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do something with the pigmen. Is that full? It's getting close to full. See ya. I wouldn't want to be ya. Alrighty then. Pigman farm coming right up. 
This should be interesting. I'd, I've never built one of these. These what I what I am imagining is going to work in my head. I have never built the like of before. Hey guys, can I just get two of you to uh, get it on? Hopefully, I didn't get mother and mother and child there because that's that's just wrong. That's just immoral. I would be an immoral person for doing that. Uh, get weapon out because it could be a short ass trip in here if there's something unpleasant around. No, no, we're good. We're good. So we're going to go through this wall, I think. And hopefully we're not going to run into the jolly green horrible ghast giant. With a little luck. That's the plan. Look at them all. We've got to do something about them. They're all over the place and they shouldn't be. Does that look far enough? That looks far enough to me. Okay, I think that's high enough. Right, okay, so now we need. Is it acknowledged my shift there? It doesn't feel very acknowledged. Look at him. He spawned on that path already. I've only just built the damn thing and he's already spawned on it. That looks like enough. Don't want to go too nuts. Don't want to go too nuts. Because two nuts would be bad. But we do want to make some progress. Make hay while the sun does shine. Yeah, I think that will do. We can always go out further the other way. Okay, we'll just keep pushing the cobblestone barrier here while we've got opportunity to do so. We're going to need some ladders out here as well. So these should start spawning on this block. It's encour it actually is encouraging that they've spawned on that block down there. On that little slab. It makes me feel better about what I'm about to do. About this plan that I have conceived. So that's, that's not that one. So that is one there. That is one there. And then if we back up along here, like so, we can go that, 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 that. There's a fire back coming. I should have bought a fire resist potion with me. This could end very badly for 30 years. This could end meteorically badly. There's a lot of fire bats around now. Where is our center line here? It's not a center line as such. Really isn't. Um, so this is this is kind of a spawning platform up here for pigmen. That's 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 the general concept anyway. It's what we want to happen. Let's get a load of cobble on our hotbar. Keep inventory, I'm sure. I'm sure Sean said that that, that works with uh, burning in lava, so I'm not too worried at the moment. Uh, it's probably better not to be flame proof in terms of thinking about burning in lava. So we need to get two ahead, don't we? And then it's easier to reach back for that one. Oop. Oh dear. Things are getting a bit out of hand here. So we should be able to get pigmen to spawn up here. But pigmen aren't naturally inclined to walk off. Which is going to be a pain. But that's why we've got all those signs. Because pigmen will be naturally unaware by their nature of a sign. 
So they should happily walk over a void. Ooh. Ooh, one too far. Fair enough. See ya, wouldn't want to be ya. So they should happily walk into a void if there's a sign over the top of it. Because they can't read, so fair enough. So that's that's my that's my theory. My theory du jour. The only other option, other problem we could have is that pigmen are going to be spawning everywhere. So that's why we've got so much glass. To try and restrict pigmen spawning to this area. So every other surface we make will be a glass surface. They shouldn't spawn anywhere but up here. Which should mean there'll be massive amounts of pigmen up here. And then they can all just plunge merrily to their doom. And uh, we can just gather up their, their goodness at will. So I hope you're seeing the general gist of what we're going for here. It's going together a lot quicker than I thought it would. I'm, I'm still massively apprehensive, I have to say. I'm not comfortable up here. Uh... So we're going to put two rows of glass around the edges up here. Where is that? This is it. Okay. Let's go down. This is going to use up my pickaxe faster than I want to. Should be able to jump off here with impunity. Kind of. This, oh, that, we, we found that chest. We emptied that chest, didn't we? There we go. There's a, there's a gas now. That's perfect timing. I don't know where he is. Look at that. And there's already a pigman up there. So we've got to get ladders up to that. And we've got to build a platform for them to hit. Uh, and this is all going to be glass. This is going to be glass. These surfaces up here will be glass. This floor will be glass. That will be glass. It's a lot of glass. That's a lot of cactuses. But the more glass we put in, the, the better the spawning locations are going to be. So that's that's good. See you, boys. But you've seen you've seen how we're starting it. Uh, we'll go and grab our signs now. Uh, but I think for the time being, from Furry Ears World, on the Sky Den, which is over there, Sky Den over there. There it is. There's the Sky Den, with the sun edging towards the the the, the horizon, to say that the day has once more waned and has, has left the vicinity and has gone away and is now is now gone dead D dead oh no I thought I got rid of them oh god I don't want to play where have it gone where have it gone all right from furry ears world cowering behind a, a lump of cobblestone ta-ta for now